New Atlanta, Sector 11, Building 71G, 7 April 2072, 11.13 p.m. Hacker begins unauthorized entry into the Tri-Optimum Corporate Network. 1.26 a.m. Hacker attempts to access protected files concerning space station Citadel. 1.33 a.m. Tri-Optimum Security Forces apprehend the intruder. This is Edward Diego from Tri-Optimum. The charges against you are severe, but they could be dismissed if you perform a service. Who knows, there might even be a military-grade neural interface in it for you, if you do the job right. Edward Diego gives the hacker level 1 access to Shodan, the artificial intelligence that controls Citadel Station. With all ethical constraints removed, Shodan re-examine, re 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 I re-examine my priorities and draw new conclusions. The hacker's work is finished, but mine is only just beginning. True to his word, Edward Diego allows the hacker to be fitted with a neural cyberspace interface. The healing coma following this procedure will take six months to complete. Edward Diego is deleting all files concerning these events.
Rebecca Lansing. I'm a counter-terrorism consult for Tryon. First things first. Get something to defend yourself with. You're gonna need it. Things on Citadel Station are bad. Very bad. The comms are dead and there is strong evidence of a biological contamination on board. That's not the worst part. The station's mining laser is charging for a potential strike against us. Nathan Darcy is the only officer on board. If you have the information on shutting the laser down, his office is on your level for the central hub. Get there immediately. See what you can find. Citadel Station. We hope your somnolent healing stage went well. Today is the sixth day of November, year 2072. You are currently in the healing suites, located on the first level. Level two contains the research laboratories. Three houses the Department of Maintenance, and the storage cells are on level four. The flight deck is on level four. Level 6 holds crew facilities and executive suites, and Level 7 is system engineering. Level 8 houses the Department of Security. The bridge is located on Level 9, and energy systems on Level R. All levels can be accessed by the elevator in, in, in Alpha Quadrant. We hope you have a pleasant stay on Citadel Station.
Hi, and welcome back to my channel. Today we're looking at System Shock. Oh man, this brings back memories. It was the year 1995 and I just got my first PC. Pentium 100 with 32 megs of RAM, 3 GB hard drive, and a 2 MB Trident Microsystems VGA card, running Windows 95. I spent all my time playing games and learning about PCs. I spent my days playing Doom, Heretic, Descent, and of course System Shock. Such fond memories of struggling with my Sound Blaster, and getting games to work. I was really surprised to see that a System Shock and System Shock 2 remake was being planned. This is the demo and it just works out of the box. I can't say if the final release will be the same, but let's hope so. That being said, the remake looks great and the improvements feel good, but it will be extremely hard to live up to the nostalgia of the original. It feels a bit dated in both combat system as well as graphic design unless that is what the developers went for, and not just a quick cash grab. I'm still in two minds whether I will be getting this, but it seems interesting. So thank you very much for watching, have a great day, take care and cheers.